Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you how to replace car fuses. So the first step is to locate the fuse box with the fuse that you need to replace. So there are basically two places that a car will likely have a fuse box and my car actually has a fuse box in both of those places so this is one of the places and you can see that um, there are some fuses some relays and some bigger fuses and those are all under the hood and then the other place is underneath the dashboard where the steering wheel is so I'm gonna try and get uh, low enough to show you right here that the fuse box is right there underneath the dashboard where the steering wheel is now I am going to show you how to replace one of the fuses so I need to replace fuse number 28 so fuse number 28 is towards the top over there now um, to remove the fuse you can either use a pair of pliers or something like this and I'll try and get it in the camera's view um, this is uh, called the fuse puller and this actually was found in the uh, fuse box underneath the hood so to pull the fuse out you just have to get the fuse puller or the pair of pliers around the fuse just like that and it's difficult because this fuse is really high up squeeze the fuse puller together and then squeeze the arms of the fuse puller together and then pull it back just like that and that will allow you to remove the old fuse now to replace it you are going to basically reverse the process with the new fuse so now I am I have seen that this fuse is blown um, because the inner portion the metal inner portion has been broken apart and I'm going to replace it with this fuse right here which has not been blown because it is a brand new fuse and I hope that the camera can catch this but the inner metal portion has not been broken apart it is one piece so to put this fuse in place I am just going to get it into position and then use my fingers to push it in place so I'm putting it into the fuse uh, number 28 slot just like that then all I have to do is use my finger my I'm using my thumb and I'm going to put some pressure and push it in place just like that and that's basically it the process is fairly simple and it just takes a little bit of time and a little bit of effort but I have shown you throughout this video how to replace car fuses it is definitely easy to do and if you follow the instructions in this video you'll be good to go and that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.